Good day. My name is Carmela G. Torres, but you can call me Carm or Carms. I'm 21 years old from Pamplona, Negros Oriental, and taking up Bachelor of Technology and Livelihood Education, major in Home Economics. The Norso Vision A dynamic, competitive, and globally responsive state university. A well-said school vision in which it gives a dynamic services and ensures to cater all students' concerns, produce a future-ready and globally competitive students that are confident to share and showcase knowledge and skills beyond school programs. The Norso Mission the university shall provide excellent instructions, relevant and responsive research and extension quality assured product through competent and highly motivated human capital. In this, Norso mission promised to provide excellent instructions which teachers teach beyond subject matter but also teach life and reality lessons. The university are actively ready to respond and participate to research and extension, gives high quality of learning materials and teaching and learning process to ensure to produce a globally competitive products. NORSU Goals NORSU strives to achieve national development through effective partnership, means NORSU are open and are ready to create partnership with both local and private sectors to promote effective connections and relationship towards education. Opportunity-laden educational access to poor but deserving students. This, nurse practice equality and just treatment to all students in which they give chances and opportunity to pick those poor but deserving students to access excellent education. Research-based and competency-driven instructions, meaning instructions given or delivered contains structured and competent activities that are research-based that cultivates students' capacity to learn. Scholarship and innovation. The university offers scholarship opportunity through different programs that help students proceed and succeed. And the last goal of NORSU is unity in diversity of cultures. NORSU is a diverse, open, and friendly environment in which it welcomes a variety of students with different cultures and backgrounds. The NORSU core values, the sapphire, S, spirituality. NORSU practices and leads upon spiritual activities that teaches every student to communicate and stay connected with God and equal treatment as well as to his or her fellow Norsunian. A. Accountability. Teachers, staffs, students, and all Norsu products are responsible and liable enough to themselves and their duty as an individual. P. Professionalism. Teachers and staffs shows being professional but kind values towards communicating to one another wherein they lead the students in how to be professional but a humble individual. P. Patriotism Norsu became a model to students in showing quality of being patriotic, how to honor, love, value, and respect to our country and helps to develop and flourish. H for harmony. It will always be the nature of Norsu in having peaceful and harmonious environment that creates good camaraderie relationships to all Norsu family and on how to be polite, respectful, and to be kind towards teachers, higher level students, staffs, and to all. I for integrity. Mursunian practices and maintains to always choose what is right, to speak the truth, have strong moral principles, and love that unites every individual. R for respect. Respect could be seen on how students and teachers interact and accept every individual's differences and embraces each opposites. E 
for excellence. The nurse will produce a high quality of products through cultivating skills and talents and improving knowledge capabilities to let students show their field of excellency. Bachelor of Technology and Livelihood Program Outcomes Demonstrate broad and coherent meaningful knowledge and skills in technology and livelihood education. As a home economic student, we are taught every field in technology and livelihood education where students are able to identify, demonstrate, apply, and are ready to teach learnings acquired from cooking, baking, sewing, house management and designs, arts, and more. The flexibility of the students' skills and knowledge are measured through demonstration assessments wherein the teachers allows and gives hands-on activities to surely develop and improve in the field. Second, apply a wide range of teaching process skills including curriculum development, lesson planning materials development, educational assessment, and teaching approaches. So the teachers and students are ready to adapt and apply wide range of teaching process skills for the reason that students are not only learning through cognitive process but also they are able to demonstrate and produce high quality outputs, creativity to instructional and project materials development that is used for teaching and are able to cope and achieve objectives and are also ready to adapt the curriculum content and teaching approaches as it is continuing to change and develop to produce a high standard learning outcomes. Third, reflect on the relationship among the teaching process skills, the learning processing students, nature of the content or subject matter, and other factors affecting educational processes in order to constantly improve their teaching knowledge, skills, and practices. We, future educator of TLE, could and are able to manage and balance relationship on our way of teaching and the behavior during the teaching process towards the competency level and learning capacity of the students towards the lessons. We are also a well-trained individual for being flexible and well-developed learners that are able to understand and comprehend teaching content and process, alert in adapting constant changes, and we apply passion in teaching. My strength is a communicator. Having conversation with different characteristics of people became my strength as a challenge because it enables me to acquire and develop my flexibility in fitting in a situation. I have this skill in adjusting up and communicating to whom I'm having a conversation with. I also have the ability to carry deep conversation with confidence along interacting and I am also an easy to speak type of person that you could talk to, friendly and enthusiastic individual that could bring life to a conversation. As a communicator and a future educator, these are my weaknesses. First is the crowd. Second, using of unintentional and wimpy words such as um, kanang, and more. Also, when the person is using high quality words, that confuses me to understand. Noise and other distractions also from my surroundings affects my skills in communicating for it lost my focus. Nevertheless, this is why I took up education to work and develop these factors for I know I could be able to speak and deliver my thoughts wisely, learn from unfamiliar words encountered, and be able to communicate a well-structured and meaningful message and as well facing crowds. And that would be all. Thank you.